ever can master those signature holes, as well as the rest of the course here at the Minnehaha Country Club, will walk away with the state-of-the-art Sanford International Tournament trophy. Now, this isn't just any ordinary tournament hardware. I spoke with Greg Conrad about the significance of the trophy to the city of Sioux Falls and this event. It was a collaboration basically between Cambria, who's our presenting sponsor, and Malcolm DeMille, who's a renowned artist out of California. This inaugural Sanford International Trophy weighs more than 40 pounds due to the heavy nature of Cambria. My biggest fear, quite frankly, is that the player will drop the trophy. It's heavy. Each year, the trophy will look slightly different than the year before, thanks to small imperfections on the stone, similar to marble. We call it our 40 pound snowflake. So every trophy will be unique. Every trophy we give to a champion will be slightly unique, slightly different. The trophy also features a metal globe breaking its way out of the stone. It was sort of like, hey, this is, this is a, a new thing, kind of like cracking your way out of an egg kind of thing. So in this, the trophy was kind of cracking its way out of the Cambria. But from the globe standpoint, uh, certainly the Sanford International, I think Sanford wanted to make sure that the world recognized that, uh, you know, Sanford's an international company, but so can Sioux Falls can be an international company, right? However, this trophy won't be traveling internationally. The champion will raise this trophy on Sunday, but a smaller version will be sent to the winner. We'll have a trophy that will live here in Sioux Falls, and it'll live in our town. And as we get more and more champions, we'll have the champions around the trophy, just like a Stanley Cup so, or a PGA Championship trophy, where you see all the names of all the winners. And this weekend's champion will be the first to see his name on the inaugural trophy at the Sanford International.